I always buy chicken that's still on the bone because it's cheaper and I keep the bones for making chicken stock. Sometimes the bones from the rib cage may still be quite large. To make it easier to remove the breast from the bones, you may want to cut a bit off. Using a pair of scissors, simply cut enough of the bone off so that the breast will lay flat while you remove the bone. To debone the chicken, all you have to do is cut along the bone with a sharp knife, separating the meat from the bone. You should actually feel the bone with every cut that you make. Keep as close to the bones as possible so that you don't waste any meat. Make sure to cut underneath the tenderloin of the breast as you move along with the knife. When you get to the tip where the wishbone is, you just need to cut around the little bone like this. If you choose to remove the skin, simply slide your fingers underneath it and pull it off. Trim off any excess fat that is left on the breast. This piece is the tenderloin. Now repeat the same process on the other side, again keeping as close to the rib cage as possible. The bones can be kept in the freezer until the next time you make chicken stock. In fact, this is plenty right here to make a batch of stock for a meal or a soup.